My name is Vasco, I'm the concert master of the orchestra. Um, a lot of people ask me the question, what is concert master? But actually, the concert master of the orchestra means the leader of the orchestra. I'm the first violin um, of the orchestra. I play all the solos in the ballets, uh, the big solos in uh, Swan Lake, in Bayadere. As well as the leader of the orchestra, it's quite an interesting job because it's not only a player of the orchestra, but you have to be pretty good on public relations. You have to help the conductor with lots of things. Sometimes, if the conductor is not too hot, uh, you kind of people look at you for for help, uh, especially from the orchestra. So it's and you have to be really good as a soloist as well because there are massive big solos, especially in the ballets. Uh, but it's a fantastic job. I've been here for the last 13 years and I absolutely love it. It's quite hard for a lot of people to imagine we are in the pit and uh, we can't see what's going on, but we are, you know, part, massive part of the music. And how do we know how to convey if uh, Scarpia is killing somebody in Tosca or, you know, uh, somebody, else, a lot of times people die in opera at the end. But, <laughs> um, I would say, well, some of us can see what's going on, but we don't actually have time. We have so, so much music to play that it's very rare that we have time to watch the stage. Um, but in the music, we have a lot of the words uh, are there, so we know what kind of is going on. The way the orchestra prepares for production is completely different from everybody else in the Royal Opera House, um, like the director or the, or the stage designers or the singers. The, but we have the conductor who basically comes to us and conveys to us all the ideas that he's been through all the rehearsals. We have sectional rehearsals where we have separately the first violins, the second violins, the cellos, the woodwinds. Um, so we first rehearse just the orchestra and a lot of people say that actually the Wagner operas are even more beautiful without the singers we, once we rehearse the music and it's amazing with some of the music how you don't even need sometimes singers but um, of course, once you have the, the, then we have the singers come in, and then we go into pr production rehearsal together with the stage and the general and and the premier. To be able to work with the greatest singers in the world, uh, and we have really the the top 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 of the world in Covent Garden in, in the Royal Opera House, it's absolutely fantastic.